to Boulder now. A call for change. This after Boulder police have a heated exchange that some say was triggered by race. Our Michael Abeda is live tonight in Boulder. Michael? Yeah, Kathy, a video of a man in Boulder police getting into a confrontation took the Internet by storm this week. Sunday, Boulder residents took to the streets to speak up for diversity and demand more police oversight. This is our community. They gathered in Boulder Sunday to speak out and to support one of their own. We're here for reasons that should be unacceptable. On March 1st, Syed Atkinson was picking up trash at his Boulder home with a trash picker when he was approached by police. I live here. I am a president. The situation escalated, and one of the police officers that responded unholstered what appeared to be a taser or a gun. My heart stopped um, because I feared that the conclusion would be the same as we've seen so many times. Since then, the Boulder police have launched an internal investigation. Black Lives Matter! Still, Sunday, hundreds of Boulder residents took to the streets to demand justice and more police oversight. We're very tired of seeing so many instances of police misconduct here in Boulder that go unchecked. Protesters marched to the police station where they heard from Zayed. I came out here today to make a stand for colored people everywhere and not just colored people, but all people in all life. This incident that happened to me could have happened to anyone. And it's not just about me, and it's not just about racial profiling. I believe that it's deeper than that. I hope to work with the people and the police department in an attempt to embrace a sense of diversity and, I, and end all violence against the people. Yes. This should not be happening anywhere. It happens every day to our brothers and sisters. I'm out here today supporting my community, promoting love, selflessness, and diversity awareness. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Boulder City Council has released a statement saying Boulder is a welcoming and inclusive community and announced a meeting to discuss racism on March 18th at 6 p.m. in the city council chambers. In Boulder, Michael Aveta covering Colorado First.